We're working on a project for the EPA here at Gonzaga. We're working on a project that really involves Katale, Kenya. We're going to turn corn into a biofuel briquette that will be used in a gasifier to burn and make a gas that can be used to power an internal combustion engine, which can then be used to generate power or run farm equipment. We're in phase one of this project right now, and that involves a, a grant for $10,000 to fund your initial research and you know, any developments you can make in that initial phase. And what we've done with that is we're taking in making our first pro part of our project, which is the, the biofuel briquettes, and then we're planning the phase two, which is to build a gasifier, which is gonna burn those biofuel briquettes and convert them into a usable energy source by giving them a means to generate their own electricity when they need it, they'll be able to accomplish all those things. Over there, cell phones are the main means of communication and you have to be able to charge your cell phone to use it and if you don't have access to electricity, you're cut off from basically all forms of communication outside of your local area. And we're also helping them to get rid of a waste issue because of the buildup of animal and human waste Being at Gonzaga, we, we get a lot of missionaries that come back here and they, they talk to us about the difference between giving people a handout and giving people the means to help themselves. We really feel like we're, we're teaching them to fish, as you'd say, because we're giving them a project that they will be able to use their own resources to generate electricity for themselves. They can use that to power farm equipment. They can use it to support their families, support themselves, better their communities, do whatever they can. It really makes us feel like we're helping some people out.